Mandy Ovi at Moon Sedai from Land of Nerds. I'm here with Joe from Cactus Brick. The is cactusbrick.com or just Cactus Brick? Cactus Brick is the name of our organization. Cactus Brick is the organization. Cactusbrick.com is your website. Yeah. All right. They have this fantastic display of Legos at the convention this year at Phoenix Comic Con, and we're going to sit here and talk about a little bit about it. As you can see in front of me is a Star Wars setup. Um, what can you tell us about the Star Wars setup? Well, this this is just one small part of our, our setup, and it's going to actually progress throughout the weekend of Comic Con. Uh, right now they're just kind of staged. The battle is about ready to begin, and tomorrow they'll be engaged. There will be, you know, snow speeders wrapping cables around the ATATs and tripping them, and and uh, there'll be casualties on both sides. So it'll be a lot of fun to see this battle progress as the weekend of Comic Con goes on. So you're basically recreating the Battle of Hoth. It looks like. That's right. That, that's right. We also have a lot of other sections, uh, you know, throughout. We have a city, a town, we have an old western town, we have uh, an adobe mission, a village there. Um, I see you have a bridge behind me over here. Yep, that's a suspension bridge we have there, and then there's another bridge on the other side with the big valley, and uh, um, yeah, it's, great. it's great. And superheroes to the right are Captain America and what are these other two? We got, we got uh, uh, cameraman. What's this other one? Uh, Captain Hammer. Captain Hammer. Yeah. Awesome. Good because Nathan Fillion also is at this convention. Right. We're going to take some shots. You're going to be able to see some of these amazing yeah. ones because we're going to take some shots later. What is your favorite piece of the of all of this? Oh, man, I, you know, what I like the most is that this is not just me. This is 15, 20 of us that all, you know, collaborate and we work together. So my favorite thing is the, the ability that we have to each bring our own piece, bring it together, mesh it and make it one big display that's uh, just enjoyable to look at. How many bricks do you think you have on display? I have no idea. Millions. Millions. It's so hard for us to count just because individually it's hard to count as you're building, you change, you take away, and, uh, and then we all bring it together. And, uh, I, but it's, it's a lot. Are there any pieces you're particularly proud of? Like uh this full set, or the bridge, you know or I'm, I'm 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 proud of the bridge. The, the the one we have, the suspension bridge I just did is new. Um, this year I just did that and just finished it a week or two before Comic Con, and I like it because it actually it's uh, structurally it's engineered just like a suspension bridge is engineered. So I'm proud of that one. Okay, so some of these are clearly going to be from the sets, the little men probably, the tauntauns, maybe the snow beast, yeah. The, yeah. but. Are any others are the, from these sets, or are these all just made up on your own? Or um, about 90% of what you see in our display, our whole display, will be um, made up from our imaginations. Uh, we we do incorporate a set um, here and there, um, like in this Hoth scene. The Lego company did a great job creating the snow speeder and the ATATs. Um, but they recreate it, right? yeah, that's right. And so, but a lot of you know the other things, uh, the buildings and the the bridges, the scenes, um, even the trains. Uh, a lot of those are um, just made up. We, we see, get ideas, we see things in real life, we see things in our mind, and we we want to create it. Awesome. Uh, how long did all of this take to set up? Because I know you didn't just come here Thursday morning. Boom, it was here. Yeah, no, no. We, actually, a lot of it we. Uh, build at home and we try to bring it uh, when we're building we try to build it modular we're thinking about how are we going to transport this big uh, display and so we make it modular we bring it it took us about um, I'd say about 12 to 14 hours about six to eight of us working at one time so a good hundred man hours just to get it set on the tables train tracks connected little guys stood up um, but it, yeah it takes quite a Quite a bit of time. For the soldiers and the yep. Troopers. Yeah, it, it takes a lot. Yeah, 100 man hours for, for sure. So. Right, let's see if there's anything. I see you have a WB tower back here. Yeah, there's uh, some of the things, uh, some of our, the members of our group like to build out of, you know, looking at real life buildings. Um, you know, that's actually a schoolhouse, um, the WB tower. Some of the micro build there is actually some of the Trovia, uh, 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 Truvi Castle um, there here in Phoenix. Um, some of the other buildings downtown in micro scale, stuff like that. So some some are real life things that we just like to, but some of it's just we get an idea and build from there. Awesome! I think we're that about wraps it up. Remember, you can see all of these amazing setups on for the next couple of days at Phoenix Comic Con. Um, do y'all have pictures of this stuff on your we website do. as well? We do. We're going to put um, pictures all over the website. We um, also on Facebook. Uh, you can join our group. Um, follow us on Facebook. It's Cactus Brick. 
and um, you can see and we also post when we're going to do another show. We're just hobbyists, we do this for fun, but we try to do a few large shows like this a year um, and so we'll post when we're going to do another show and when you can come check us out. All right, that's Moon Sedai from Land of Nerds. We'll be posting this on our Facebook and on our on our website and all of our social media as well. It was very good to talk with you, Joe, and Cactus Brick. Have a nice day.